it's going actually pretty well. I'm almost done writing up the results. The paper is looking good. Good morning everyone, welcome to another study vlog. My name is Ginny and I'm a second year PhD student in Canada in the Department of Medicine with a specialization in immunology and clinical HIV research. And I'm very happy to report that recently I passed my PhD qualifying exam. I've talked a little bit more about the qualifying exam before in other videos, but very briefly, it's an oral defense exam that I have to take at the end of my second year of my PhD studies so that I can qualify to continue into the rest of my PhD years. After I pass the qualifying exam, what's next? Scholarship season for graduate school is coming up soon. I would say that throughout the year, there's two big chunks of time that is scholarship season heavy. One would be during February to March-ish, which has already passed. And the other one is at the end of August to beginning of September, which is coming up. Right now is around the time that I'm trying to beef up my CV, my resume, and just my overall application so that I have a better chance of winning scholarships into next year. Most graduate students in Canada gets paid a stipend, so it's basically like a yearly salary. So if I don't win this scholarship, it's not the end of the world, I still get paid. But winning a scholarship means more money for me throughout the year, as well as more funding for my supervisor to continue to fuel my research and my thesis. With scholarship applications, they really judge you not only on your academic merit, also your holistic CV and resume. And one of the big considerations, at least from what I've heard, is publications. And the more publications you have, the more points you get or the better score that you get. So the goal for the next month and a half to two months is just to get my publications going. I have two papers that I want to get done, written, and at least submitted to journals by the end of August so that they can also make it onto my scholarship application. One paper is already drafted and done, sent to my supervisor for comments and reviewing, and the other one I have not started yet, so that's the goal for today. It's gonna be a short paper, about 4,000 words or so. So my goal today is to get the entire paper drafted. I'll also be doing some coding in R so that I can do some biostats. Because I'm in a clinical lab, a lot of our research stems from biostatistics and being able to look at numbers and data. And we work with R to code some of our stats. I am not that great at coding. I would say I used to hate coding and then I would never have thought that one day I would end up in a lab that would require me to code. 
but I feel like the more I do it, the more fun it gets. I am still really slow at it though, so I'm hoping to get this done in five hours so that I can stop working at about 4 to 5 p.m. and then just end my workday there and relax for the rest of the day. Okay, so outfit change because I want to go out and do work outside, maybe at a library or a cafe. I originally was going to work fully from home today. It's 29 degrees right now outside. Literally like my room is baking in heat and I can't concentrate anymore. So I'm gonna run some errands and then sit down somewhere with AC and just work for a couple more hours before coming home. So here's what it's looking like so far. I have just some more data wrangling that I'm doing, working hard on coding. It's going actually pretty well. I haven't met any kinks yet, so that's really good. So I'm just about done the intro, the methods, and I'm almost done writing up the results. I'm gonna go out and run some errands. All the stores that I need to visit close at like 5 or 6 p.m. and it's now almost 4, so I gotta go and get running and I'll see you there.
so late so I think I'm just gonna call it a night here but I think I made really good progress today the paper is looking good so far I don't feel stressed out at all I think I made really really good progress I think I'm just gonna stop doing work here and get ready for bed Thank you. 